Welcome. In front of me is a Samsung Galaxy X Cover 5, and today I'll show you how to hard reset the device through recovery mode. Now, this process will also remove a screen lock if you have one that you just don't know, uh, although the process will be a little bit trickier. So, uh, if you want to factory reset your device and you have a pattern that you know, or screen lock, then you can just simply turn it off, right? Uh, but if you don't know your combination to your screen lock, uh, then you will need to perform a combination of keys uh, that you need to hold. So it's going to be power key and volume down. And you're going to wait till the device turns off, at which point you're going to switch to holding power key and volume up. So I'll quickly lock the device just so you can see I do have a pattern right here. And I'm going to progress from the lock screen as though I don't know it. Now additionally, we'll also need a cable for it. You want to plug it into your computer, which for me that is already connected. You can see it's charging now. So anyway, once you plug it in, uh, get it to well, the pattern screen right here just so you can see the screen uh, because once it turns off, uh, then that also means that the phone has turned off. Uh, but when it's like this and you start holding the keys, you won't know when it turned off. So power key, volume down. Switch to volume up now. And once you see the uh, Galaxy addition to the Samsung logo, you can let go and simply wait for the recovery mode, mode to show up. And there we go. And from here, you will need to use a volume keys to navigate, as you can see. Uh, that screen just doesn't work at all. So with that in mind, you want to scroll down in order to select wipe data factory reset. Confirm it with power key and select factory data reset. Once you confirm it, it goes through the process, then gives you message data wipe complete right at the bottom. And also reboot system now will be selected by default. So all you need to do is press power key once more and this will initiate reboot. Now while it's rebooting, you can also unplug it. The cable is not needed anymore. Now this will take a couple minutes, so just be patient, but once it's finished, you should then be greeted with the Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that is visible. And as you can see, now the process is finished and you can set up your device however you like. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.